Good morning, everybody. Thank you for showing up. There's a whole lot of places you could have gone, but you're here. Thank you for that. Uh, my name is Tim Passhausen. I'm the co-founder and chief strategy officer of uh, Sidecore Content Hub. And I'm very proud today to introduce Brent and Chris at EPAM, who are going to give you um, their findings with Content Hub, um, an introduction, but also a live demo. Who thinks it's brave to give a live demo? <laughs> so, as some of you may know, uh, the acquisition of uh, Stylabs Content Hub was uh, announced uh, about exactly a year ago at a previous symposium. For a lot of people uh, in the partner network, that was actually the first introduction to Content Hub. Um, Stylabs originally, 2001, started off as a systems integrator, and we turned products in the last five years. Um, so we've been where these people are. We've been in the trenches. We've been working with third-party products, trying to make them work to deliver the value for our customers. And so when we developed Content Hub, we wanted to develop a great product that would be great for the customer, but also a great product that would be great to implement, that would give a tool to our partner network where they could deliver value for the customer and have some fun in the process. So um, these two guys, both solution architects at EPAM, about as stacky as you get them, I guess, <laughs> are going to tell you uh, their unbiased opinion about Content Hub. Um, and quite frankly, I'm looking forward to hear it. I hope you do the same. Thank you. Okay, so I'm um, understanding uh, the Content Hub lifecycle. Um, so we're going to start. Our, we're going to start off with uh, going through a little bit of what Content Hub is. There's a lot of misunderstandings of, of what it is. A lot of people think it is just DAM. Um, it's a lot more than that. Um, and then after I go through that, um, Brent's going to go through uh, talking about why this is really a, a huge game changer that we do have Content Hub as uh, as an option to to use um, for for these solutions. Um, and then we're going to go through uh, some of the components to say what they do and how you can use them, and go through a little bit of. Um, life cycle, um, and then we'll do a live demo, and then Q and A. Um, so this slide here um, will be very, maybe familiar to some of you. Um, uh, Sacred Content Hub um, is really, I, I see it as a, a trilogy in four parts, um, which is kind of a little bit of a tacky joke, but also um, very true in this case. Um, so you have uh, Dam, um, which uh, actually. Um, it goes, goes very well paired with, uh, with PCM. Um, and then you have your, um, your MRM component, which um, is your marketing, uh, marketing resource manager. And then you have your, uh, your CMP, which is your content marketing platform. And then you have your, your web to print. Um, so I'm gonna go over each of the different components. So DAM, you're probably more familiar with. Um, so that's where you put all of your assets um, that's where you're storing all of your metadata, um, you're running all of your auto-tagging, you're making sure that all of your assets are approved, um, you're, uh, you're matching that up with your DRM uh, contracts, which are actually stored in Content Hub, um, and you've got version control on your, on your assets. Um, the content marketing platform, which I feel is actually the most powerful piece of, of, of this whole suite, um, allows you to store and to manage and, and edit all of your content for your campaigns, manage all your campaigns in one spot, get it approved in one spot, um, and, and all of that. Um, so it's, it's very important to save you a lot, of, a lot of time because instead of looking all over for your assets, you're, you're going to one spot. Um, the marketing resource manager, um, in the development community, we've had Jira for a long time, um, and that's really helped us with that. Um, now with marketing resource manager, you now have that in the marketing space to be able to run your projects the same kind of way and have that much more um, efficiency. So you, you're managing multiple projects and your tasks and you'll be able to keep track of resources that are on multiple projects and, and uh, assigned to different people and, and stuff like that. So very powerful. Um, and then you have uh, web to print, um, which allows you to take that content that's, that, that's in there and, and also uh, push it over to your, uh, to your, offline, uh, your offline channels. 